Hey guys, uh, welcome to a new episode on the channel and to a new channel name, I must say, because uh, we changed the channel name from Touring with Jim to 939 Driver. Uh, 939 is the type code of uh, the 159 and the Brera. And since my channel is mainly evolved around those cars, I thought it would be better fitting uh, to change the name. I also like other cars, and uh, my dream car is a white Alfa Romeo 4C Coupe. And I even have cars from other car brands that I really like. Car brands that might be uh, curse words to some of his team Audi, BMW. But uh, yeah. I will always drive a, a, a 939 because I really love these. So yeah, that uh, explains that. And uh, now uh, continue with uh, with the episode. This episode is all about installing these bad boys. So BMC air filter and a wizard uh, straight through rear section uh, exhaust. And you might be thinking, wasn't next video going to be about uh, installing the, the newly painted TI wheels? That was the plan, but uh, yeah, the paint shop was very busy, so it took a long time uh, for them to uh, get painted. But they did come back from the paint shop this week, and they look are looking absolutely stunning. So I ordered uh, tires for it, uh, so that is all coming uh, very soon uh, in another video. But in this video, we're going to install the the exhaust. So uh, the car is already lifted up at the back. So, uh, yeah, we're going to install it. A few moments later
Many unbearable hours later. So guys, after some uh, intense hammering and uh, battling and cursing, uh, the old exhausts uh, are out. Not sure why I decided to do this on a 30 plus degree day, because I'm absolutely sweating. But the good news is they're out. The only bad news is uh, the new exhaust then came with uh, clamps. So I'm going to order new ones. But I do want to install them already so um, I'm going to use the clamps on the old exhaust so I'm going to have to grind off uh, one weld and then we can uh, flip them over to the new exhaust and uh, clamp it uh, uh, tight so yeah let's uh, install the exhaust
guys, the clamps are loose. Um, I only made a very stupid mistake because these need to be on the pipe before mounting because there's no way you can get these over the existing pipe. Uh, so that's a little bit dumb. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I have new clamps on order. So uh, clamps that I can mount uh, on the exhaust. Um, right uh, diameter but what i'm going to do now is improvise <laughs> because i do want to uh, drive uh, for now so i'm going to use a hose clamp to mount the exhaust uh, uh, for now and then we're going to switch uh, to the right clamps as soon as they are uh, delivered So guys, we are going to uh, replace the standard uh, paper air, air filter with uh, this PMC uh, air filter. These are a lot less restrictive and they're also washable. I have these uh, in my Brera and uh, yeah, uh, never had a problem with them. And BMC and for instance KNN. Uh, they sell regenerating kits for these so you can wash them out yearly or every 10,000 kilometers. They are less restrictive and that can result in a, a little bit of a gain of uh, power. And also uh, you get a bit more induction noise which on a turbo engine is uh, really cool. And so we are going to install this one.
So guys, uh, the Wizard exhaust is installed on the 159 and I've done some driving now and I must say I'm really impressed. Uh, it sounds absolutely perfect now. I was afraid that it was going to be a bit too loud because there are no silencers on the exhaust but it's absolutely perfect. It's a bit louder on startup which is really cool but on normal driving and normal cruising it's almost no difference with the stock exhaust. It's not annoyingly loud it's not resonating so that's really perfect i was afraid of that but it's just yeah the sound is amazing when you put pressure on the the throttle pedal and you accelerate a bit harder then then the sound really kicks in and becomes much more sporty so yeah i'm absolutely loving uh, how it sounds now the reason why i went for a wizard exhaust uh, setup is because i think uh, the look of the exhaust tips is absolutely perfect. There are a lot of uh, custom exhausts uh, on the market for the 159, but a lot of them are either extending out too much of the bumper or have a little bit of a weird shape or angle on them. And what I love about the Wizard exhaust is that it looks absolutely OEM. The, the shape, the angle and, uh, and yeah, the design of the, the exhaust tips is very OEM, but it's just a lot bigger which yeah but is exactly what i was looking for and the sound is amazing now as well so really glad uh, i went for them and uh, i can highly recommend them also uh, the new clamps uh, are in so i'm going to mount them as well and for next episode uh, the tires are coming in as well so we can mount the wheels and then we go uh, for a nice drive with 159 i'm going to say thank you for watching and hope to see you next uh, episode arrivederci Thank you.